Well, hello and welcome. Hello, esteemed judges of the face of Walker. Hello, everybody watching from around the world. My name's Melanie Palby, and today I want to speak to you about a sea we've been having to deal with for the past year and a half in most cases. But I want you to be able to see the chance to turn this sea around. So I want to speak to you about the five C's that I think hold the secret to not only being able to navigate this whole situation, but also learn new things, become better, grow, and be able to thrive, even amidst this hard, hard, really, really hard times for everybody all over the world. So the first one would be connection. At the beginning of this pandemic, many people were feeling isolated. And for this reason, right at the start of the pandemic, we pledged on Expo Channel TV to bring connection to the audience. So we started doing a number of special shows so that people could connect. People to just come, join, mingle, connect, be able to find that sense of belonging. Because we all need connection. And people now more than ever are craving connection. And the beauty of being able to use this technology is that we connect we're able to connect to people from all over the world. So let's make use of this. And if you're feeling isolated, just use social media. It's a great tool when used properly. Find your tribe, connect to people. We need to feel part of a group. My second C would be creativity. And again, on Channel TV, we were doing all sorts of special shows, March 2020 because we wanted people to look at the reality from a different perspective. Very often, when we're in the middle of something, we're not able to see anything beyond. We are not able to see the solutions. We feel trapped. We can only see one way, and that is often not the best way. So I just want you to do this exercise for any situation you have, any situation you might be struggling with. Try to go outside the picture. Try to look at that situation from different perspectives. And believe me, it will change everything. Looking at something from different angles will give you different viewpoints. And this can only bring more ideas and solutions. Also, in order for us to feel creative, we need to take good care of ourselves. So that takes me to the third C, care, self-care. I know with everything we've been going through, parents having to homeschool, and work from home, it's really, really hard to find time for self-care. But try to find, even if it's one minute, two minutes, five minutes a day, where you're just on your own, in your favorite place, in your home or outdoors, and just breathe. You don't need to do anything too big, anything too complex. Just breathe. Try to connect to your breathing. Try to enjoy that moment that me time, it will help you be more creative. It will help you stay grounded and it will help you connect to others, which leads me to number four. C number four is community. This is really, really connected to connection. <laughs> so community is really helpful, especially in times of struggle, times of uncertainty, having a group, a community where you can learn, grow, having a community that will celebrate your wins and will cry with you if necessary. Find your community. There is bound to be a community for you. And to wrap up, C number five is clarity. Being still, being quiet, having had to stop lots of the activities we were used to do has really helped us connect to what moves us, what makes us get up every morning. So try to connect to those core values. Try to find clarity. Find your purpose. Why do you do what you do? And if you can't find an answer, maybe you will find clarity in doing something different. And they're all connected. You can find clarity by being in the right community, by taking good care of yourself, by being creative and finding other ways to do things, and by feeling connected. So those are my five C's. And I want you to change the C, the terrible C we've had to deal with for too long now and turn it around into chances, chances, opportunities. 
thank you so much for watching i will see you again very very soon